Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and this is my 936th Energy Drink Review video. It's 5.45 p.m., and it's Thursday, November 2nd, 2017. Today I'm going to be reviewing the last one of these highball organic energy drinks that I got from the Aikens Natural Market in Bixby. It was $2.30, so it was pretty cheap. It was okay priced. But anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the Blood Orange Highball Organic Energy Drink. Oh yeah, it would have been better if I reviewed this one after the Black Cherry one on Halloween because Black and Orange are Halloween colors. But I forgot to make that one review before work. Well, I didn't forget, I just didn't have time to make the review. So I had to make that after work before I did the Black Cherry one. So, so this one got delayed a little bit, but you know what I mean. But anyway, it has a silver top with a black highball tab. Around the top it says organic orange juice, organic caffeine, organic grana extract, organic ginseng extract, and B vitamins. Blood orange, USDA organic highball energy, organic energy drink. Organic orange juice, organic caffeine, organic sugar. Fair trade certified ingredient, 83% of product, 16 fluid ounces, 1 pint, 473 milliliters. It says the same thing on this side. The bottom is the best buy date. Best Buy, March 2nd, 2019. Has the ball logo, some other code in the SKU, and the Highball Energy logo, and the Recycling logo. Phone number is 1-877-269-2003. Highballer.com. I recommend for children, pregnant, or breastfeeding women, or individuals sensitive to caffeine. Contains 5% organic juice, nutrition facts, serving size 1 can. Amount per serving, calories 160, total fat 0 grams, 0%. Sodium, 0 mg, 0%. Total carbs, 40 grams, 13%. Sugars, 39 grams. Protein, 0%. I mean, 0 grams. Niacin, 150%. Vitamin B6, 150%. Vitamin B12, 150%. And pantothenic acid, 150%. Has other ingredients. Has orange juice concentrate and cane sugar. And certified organic. Fair trade certified by Fair Trade USA. Manufactured for Highball Incorporated, San Francisco, California, 94123. Certified organic by Oregon Tilth Incorporated. Organic Garana is 50 milligrams. Organic ginseng is 50 milligrams. And organic caffeine is 160 milligrams. So it has 160 milligrams caffeine in the entire can. Has a cool orange polka dot pattern. It looks very cool. I like it. Very pretty can, that's for sure. Very nice. But anyway, I'll let you see the can now. Okay. Hopefully this one will be good. I wasn't too impressed by the last one, the black cherry one. Thought it would be pretty good, but it turned out it wasn't. It had like a weird taste. So hopefully this one will be better. Maybe. We shall see. Okay, now for the nutrition fact side. And there's other flavors of these, but um... They didn't have them at the Aikens Natural Market. I know there's a ginger ale flavored one, and also there's some coffee ones. But the Natural Market that's near me didn't have them. So I'll have to get them sometime maybe and review them. But anyway, that's pretty much the whole can. So I'm going to shake it up, open it, taste it, and give my review for it. So hold on a minute. Okay, I opened it, and the smell... Oh wow, oh wow, wow, whoa, wow. <sighs> I had something that smells very similar to this. And something I wasn't expecting. <sighs> oh wow. It reminds me of one of my favorite monsters that sadly was a limited time release. Uh, and it was quickly, like, discontinued. Oh wow, it reminds me of the M100 Monster Phantom. Oh yeah. Has that orange smell, but also smells like melon a little bit. 
like maybe a honeydew melon. Oh wow, yeah, it reminds me of Monster Phantom. Oh yeah, doesn't really smell like Ultra Sunrise or the Orange Aid Rehab. Well, it might smell like the Orange Aid Rehab a little bit, but without the tea. But I think the closest drink I had that smells like this is the Phantom. And that was like a blood orange type of drink. I know TPX said it was like blood orange, but um, to me though, it was like a orange with like honeydew melon, so. I guess there's different types of blood orange, because the blood orange Mountain Dew Kickstart didn't taste like this at all. Or it didn't smell like it, you know what I mean? Either way. Anyway, it smells really good. The color's like a clear color, but with like a little tint of orange. Can't really see it that good, but you know what I mean? Anyway, it smells really good, and I'm gonna try it. Here goes. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Ooh. Well, the smells like M100 Monster Phantom, but the taste is different. The taste is, um, has a little bit of a weird taste, but not as weird as the black cherry one. Hmm. It does taste like M100 Phantom a teeny bit. But, um... I don't know if it's because of the organic ingredients and might be a little bit different tasting, and that might be why. But I know the smells like M100 Monster Phantom, but the taste is different. It smells really good though. Um, the taste, um, it starts out sweet, and then it gets like a weird taste, but it's like not as nasty as the black cherry one. It's a little bit tart. A little bit tangy. Um, I'm trying to figure out how to describe that weird taste a little bit. Reminds me a little bit of like apple juice a teeny bit. Yeah, but like a nastier type of apple juice. Not like a good brand one, I don't know. But yeah, still, actually do like it better than the Black Cherry one. Has a really cool can design, I like it. It was okay priced, it was $2.30 at the Aikens Natural Market. Energy-wise, lasts about four and a half hours, about five and a half hours of energy, so it works pretty good. The taste is good, but it does have a little bit of a weird taste, but um, it's not as bad as the Black Cherry one. And the Black Cherry one I could drink, but like, I still don't prefer it. Like, probably won't buy more of it. This one, though, I'd buy more of. It's actually okay. So I'm going to give the Blood Orange Highball Organic Energy Drink an 8 out of 10. So yeah, my next five reviews are going to be some drink mixes I got from the Aikens Natural Market. Stay tuned for those reviews. I think so far my favorite Highball Organic Energy Drink is either the Wildberry one or the Ruby Red one. Those two are really good, and I definitely recommend trying them. This one's still okay, though, so you can still try it, though. You might like it. But anyway, just to do more reviews, to do more videos, thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye.